Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. In today's video, I am going to show you how to annotate PDF files using this amazing software. Name of the software is a first soft PDF. So let's start. So first of all, I will open a first soft PDF. So guys, this is an AI powered PDF editor. You can use this software to view, annotate, edit, convert, OCR, organize, create and summarize PDFs. The best thing about this software is you can use one license across all platforms. So let's start. The first feature is about how to convert PDF files to Word, PowerPoint, Excel or image. So I will open a first soft PDF, then I will go to files and then on top left corner you can see we have this plus icon. So I will select this plus icon and then I will select my PDF file. For example, I want to edit this PDF file. So I select this PDF file and then I will open it. So you can see this PDF file contains a lot of text images and I also have different diagrams. Now I want to convert this PDF file into Word file without changing the format. So you can see on top we have this convert option. I will select this convert option and then you can see we have this option of to Word. So I will select to Word and then I will select this convert button and then it will start converting my PDF file into Word file. So you just have to wait for a few seconds. Now you can see everything is done and here is my word file. So I will open this word file and you can see here on this word file everything is exactly the same. You can see the same diagrams with the same drawings and you can also edit it as well. So for example I want to edit the text. I can easily edit this text if you want to delete some images. So for example I want to delete this image so I can easily delete it. Now the next thing is if you want to convert this word file back into PDF file you just have to use a first soft PDF. So first of all I will save this word file. So I will save it from here and then I will minimize it and then I will open a first soft PDF. Now you can see I have this tools option available. I will select tools and then here you can see I have this option of create PDF. So I will select create PDF and then I will select my word file. So here is the word file and then I will open it. Now you can see it will start processing your word file and here is the final result. So after converting your word file, here is your PDF file. So you can see with all the edited text and you can see I delete the diagram from here. So everything is perfectly fine. So now I can share this PDF file. The next thing is you can also convert your PDF files into PowerPoint slides. So I will open a first soft PDF then I will select this plus icon and then I will select my PDF file. So I will select this PDF file and then I will open it. Now this time I want to convert this PDF file into PowerPoint slides. So I will select this convert option from here and then you can see I have this option of to PowerPoint. So I will select to PowerPoint and then I will select convert. So now it will start converting the same PDF file into PowerPoint slides. So you just have to wait for a few seconds. So you can see everything is ready. Now I will open my PowerPoint slides. So I will open it from here. You can see so here is the final result. So it convert all of different pages into slides. So you can easily jump to any page. You can also do your editing and you can share these slides as well. The next thing you can also do batch convert. So I will open a first soft PDF then I will select this plus icon and then I will select this PDF file and then I will open it. Now I want to convert multiple files together. So I will go to this convert option okay and then here you can see we have this option of batch convert. So I will select this batch convert. So here you can see I have this option of add files. So I will select this add files option then I will select one more PDF file and then I will open it. So here you can see I have two different PDF files. Now I want to convert these two files together. So I will select this convert option and then it will start converting both of these files. So now it will convert both of these files into word file. You just have to wait for a few seconds and you can see everything is done and now you can see I have 
two word files available so here is the first one and here is the second one now you can use both of these files the next feature is about OCR for example I took a picture of this document from my mobile phone and now I want to convert this text into editable text so I will use a first soft PDF so I will open a first stock PDF and then here you can see we have this option of tools so I will select this tools option and then here you can see we have this option of create PDF I will select create PDF then I will select this image and then I will open it so now you can see the image is available over here now on top you can see we have this option of OCR so I will select this OCR option and then I will select perform OCR now it will start converting this document into editable document and then I will show you how you can edit the text in this document so here is the same document after OCR now for example I want to edit this text I will select this edit all option and then you can see I can easily edit this text so you can see I can easily edit the text inside the same document if you want to remove the text you can also remove it you can also use other tools for example if you want to use this highlighter you can also use this highlighter as well so this is really really amazing once you finish with your editing you can save it and you can share it the next feature is about using AI to summarize your PDF and asking questions. So I will open a first soft PDF and then I will select this plus icon and then I will select any PDF file. For example, I select this PDF file and then I will open it. Now the next thing is you can see I have this option of a first soft AI. So I will select this option and then here you can see I can submit the same PDF file so I will select this start option and then it will start summarizing this whole PDF for me you just have to wait for a few seconds so here you can see now it is start showing me the summary for the same PDF the next thing is you can also ask any question using AI so I will ask about impact of diabetes and then I will send so here you can see it will start analyzing the same document and then it will start giving you the answer so this is really really amazing so this way you can chat with your PDF file you can also copy all of this information so here you can see this copy option available so you can copy it and then you can use it in other platforms the next feature is about PDF editing so I will open a first soft PDF then I will select this plus option and then I will select my PDF file and then I will open it now for example I want to edit this text inside my PDF file so you can see on top we have this option of edit so I will select this edit option and then you can select your text for example you want to add some text over here you can easily add your text and then if you want to remove it you can also remove your text from here on right side we have all the text tool available you can select any font style you can also change the size for your font and we also have other text tools available you can also change the alignment for your text the next thing is you can also add any image so here we have this add image option I will select add image for example I want this image so I will select this image and then I will open it now you can see the same image is available and I can place it anywhere on my PDF file and on right side I also have these image tools available so you can crop it you can change the alignment and you can do all the other editings for this image the next thing is you can also add any link so here is the link option so I will select link from here and then you can select add or edit link and then you can select any part of your PDF file for example I want to add a link over here so I will just select it like this and then here I will select this option to open a web page you can enter your URL and you can apply it so your link will be available in your PDF file you can also crop page so here is the crop page option so you can also crop your PDF page from here so for example I want to crop this PDF file so you can see I can just easily crop it like this the next feature is about PDF annotation 
So I will open a first soft PDF and then I will select this plus icon and then I will select my PDF file and then I will open it. Now for example I want to annotate this PDF file. So you can see on top we have this option of comment. So I will select this comment option and here we have all the PDF annotation tools available. For example, if you want to highlight this text, you can select this highlighter. You can select any color from here. For example, I select this color and now you can select the text. So for example, I will select this text till here. So now you can see the text is now highlighted. The next tool is this underline tool. So you can select this underline tool and then you can also select any color. For example, I select this green color and then you can select your text. So I will select this text for underlining. So I will underline it till here. Now you can see the underlining has been done. Now the next tool is strike through tool. So you can select this strike through tool, select any color. For example, I select this red color and then you can select your text and then you can use this strike through tool. The next one is this tilde, you can select it, you can select any color from here. For example, I select this blue color and you can also use this tilde tool for your text. The next one is sticker. So you can select this sticker tool from here. It will show you different categories of stickers. So you can select any category. For example, we have mood, mark, number, note, so we have a lot of other categories also available. You can select any of these categories. For example, I will select this note. Okay. And then from here, you can select any sticker. For example, I select this sticker and then you can bring it anywhere on your PDF. For example, I will bring it over here. And then if you want, you can also change the size for this sticker and you can also change the position for this sticker as well inside your PDF. Once you finish, you can select this file option and you can save it and you can also export it. The next feature is about organize PDF. So I will open a first soft PDF and then I will open my PDF file. So here is my PDF file and now I want to organize this PDF file. So you can see on top we have this option of page. So I will select this page and then it will show you all the pages of your PDF. Now, for example, you want to rearrange these pages. So for example, I want to bring this page to the first position. So I will press and hold it like this and I can easily drag and drop it to the first location. So now you can see the page is available over here. Same thing you can do for the other pages as well. The next thing is you can also extract any single page. So for example, I want to extract this page. I will select this page. Here is the extract option. So I will select it and then here you can select this extract option and then you can extract this single page as PDF file. The next thing is you can also delete any page. For example, I want to delete this page. I will select it like this and then here is the delete option. So I will use this option and then I will press OK. So the page is deleted. You can also crop any page. For example, I want to crop this page. I will select it like this. Here is the crop page option. So I will select it like that and then you can see I can easily crop my page using this tool. The next feature is about protect PDF. So you can protect your PDF file using a password. So I will open a first soft PDF and then I will open my PDF file. So for example, I want to protect this PDF file. So you can see on top we have this option of protect. I will select this protect option and then here you can see we have this option of encrypt. So I will select this encrypt option and then here you can see you can set a password over here. The next feature is search by word. So I will open a first soft PDF and then I will open my PDF file. Now for example, I want to search specific word inside this PDF file. So here you can see I have this search icon available. So I will select this search icon and then here I will type the word. For example, I will write here ventricular. So it will show me all the search results related to same word. So here you can see 
now it is very easy for me to access the relevant information so for example i want to go over here i can just select it like this it will directly bring me to that specific page and it will also highlight the same word the next feature is about view PDF. So I will open a first soft PDF and then I will open my PDF file. So here you can see I have one page option available on my screen. But if you want two pages on your screen, you can select this option of view. So here on top we have this view option. You can select it and then here you can see we have this option of single page. You can select this arrow and here we also have this option of two page. So I will select this two page option and now you can see I have two pages available on my screen. Now I can easily access two pages for this PDF. You can also select this zoom option and here we have multiple options available. You can go for fit height, you can also go for fit width and you can also go for actual size and fit window. You can also select full screen option. So for example, I will select this full screen option. So now my PDF is available on full screen. I can easily move between different pages inside the same PDF. So this will be really, really helpful. So guys, this software is available for PC, Mac, Android, iOS and web. And you can see it is very user friendly with easy to use interface. So you can also use free online tool. You can get started with this amazing software. You can try this for free or you can enjoy the special offer. I already gave links in description. So guys, this is for today's video. Please like this video and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.